down no father like I'm Naruto. Keep the blade on me, Ichigo. Who really wanna go toe for toe? TT off from Tokyo. Diamonds flipping up on the stove. Lucky man like a fully cloak. Diamonds wanna go. Hello everyone, my name is Nagato's Revenge and welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are having a great day for today. In today's video, I'm gonna be showcasing on how to install X Project version 1.5.6 on your 5.05 PlayStation 4, and this method does work on firmwares lower than 5.05. With that being stated out the way, please be sure to follow my latest social media so you know the latest hacking guides and tutorials for my channel. And as well, if you do want to join my official Discord, I'll have a link in the description below, or you could look on the screen right now. And in my Discord, Discord, I'll basically have a community where you can meet new people that is in the hacking slash modding scene Also in my community you can go ahead and check for the latest hacking guides and tutorials for your favorite consoles Such as the PlayStation 3 Vita and PS4 and also if you just want access to useful homebrew with download links You could go ahead and check my discord for that as well And if you do want to support my channel in any shape or form you can feel free to donate via my PayPal any of the money that I will receive via a donation will go back to my channel so it will help me buy you know a computer equipment help me buy a better mic for recording um help me buy software for editing or even you know buy a console so i could showcase that and how to hack that or mod that on the channel but with that being stated out the way what we're going to do is get started on the things you need and the prerequisites for this video and any of the items i state in this video there will be downloads and a link in the description below so of course you need a modded playstation 4 that is on firmware is either 1.76 4.05 4.55 or 5.05 to do this method so if you have those systems you could go ahead and do this unfortunately you can't do this on firmware is higher than 5.05 as of you know 2019 due to not a being a higher exploit released from like 5.05 and higher as well you need a windows 10 pc you also need the x project 1.5.6 http server edition zip i'll have a link in the description for that as well and also you need a wi-fi connection for the initial install for this process as shown here before we even get started on the initial uh, setup on the PC I just want to go ahead and state some tips and reminders so there are a multitude of ways of installing X project such as the Al Azarus DNS server and also the lethal 1.0 mod you also have the HTTP exploit host server this is the one I'm showcasing in this video and also you have the ESP edition which is that like little um, motherboard jig looking thing and also you have live hosted websites which is probably the easiest method what live hosted uh, uh, websites you can just type in the URL bar into your PlayStation 4 as one browser and basically you can get X project that way um so there is a multitude of ways of that of course I will have the official um GBA temp link on how to set all those items as well or basically all those methods as well and just for another tip and reminder to enable a uh, fake packages or homebrew you need to always utilize X project and run the latest version of hen to you know run your fake package games and files and just to showcase here right now here is a change log i'm not going to go ahead and read through all of that stuff right now but as showcased on the screen you just pause it and then you know read the change logs from here and with that being stated out the way some frequently asked questions i've read from the uh, gba temp um here's that showcased on the screen so one of the questions were um there are too many payloads in there if you don't want all those payloads for whatever reason you could remove them by um just deleting it from the index uh, .json file and then you could just rerun the make catch bat to basically from your payloads to you know take them out um if you can't run a second payload uh an easy method to fix that is just pressing the playstation button and re-entering the web browser between each payload that's just one thing i already know off the back um just to you know, quickly skim through other frequently asked questions if you basically get a kernel panic don't worry your playstation 4 is not burnt or anything all you got to do is just restart the console and then when it's crashed just use your power button and then it's going to basically boot you back to the main ui and then you could just go ahead and start from there to basically run any uh payload from x project um if you're having zero or excuse me oom errors um if you get more than three there is an issue so just hold down the circle button to close 
every app or basically any open tab then playstation button back up from your browser reboot and then start from your playstation 4 again so basically just do a hard reset and then if your system lags it's just only due to the fact if you using large payloads or multiple payloads that have been ran successfully so for example if you're using a uh, grand theft auto 5 payloads i noticed that with me personally in the past if it's a huge uh payload it may take a little while especially if you're trying to use any mods and cheats and stuff like that um but with that being all stated out the way i just want to give a special thanks out to default dmb and lethal 74 for creating this for the whole scene so big shout out to them and any other developers i didn't mention who needed to be credited so shout out to you guys and as well i just want to give a special thanks to my fans and supporters for helping me grow my channel every day so thank you guys for watching so far and with that being stated out the way we could go ahead and get started on the pc portion of this tutorial Alrighty guys, so assuming that you did follow all the prerequisites as stated in the intro, we could go ahead and get started on the actual PC portion of this tutorial. So as shown here, here is X project. I basically have the .zip file and all I did with one more is just extract it to our desktop. So once you do that as well on your end, if you just open up the main uh, file right here, just by double clicking on it, you'll get another file that was called regular self host version. And then via right here, it's fairly simple on how to utilize this as well. So all you would need to do for um, this process is just go into exploit host server version 1.2.exe. And then what will happen is, let me go ahead and maximize this. It will literally uh, state your local IP and your port. And then all you would need to do is just to keep this uh, basically open. And then onto your PlayStation 4 browser, you need to go to type this in right here. And then just type in your IP address with this uh, web address via right here so that's what I'm gonna do so that's essentially how you set up um, from the PC side so it's very simple and easy but what I'm gonna do now is transfer over to the PlayStation 4 and then showcase on how to get this set up Alrighty guys, so as shown here, I'm back onto my PlayStation 4, and as you can tell, I am on my 5.05 system, since you can see I already have some emulators installed and some homebrewing games like that. But what we need to do now is fairly simple, is just to go into our internet browser right here, and then just from that uh, same thing that was shown up via with the xproject http server edition we just need to go ahead and type in that you uh basically that website into our ul bar so what i'm going to do here is just go ahead and minimize this out and then i'm going to go ahead and type http my ip of choice i already did uh some of this so your ip of course will be different but all you would need to do is just go ahead and hit r2 on your controller and as shown here basically here is X Project 1.5.6, and it's pretty cool. Um, there is a lot of uh, new stuff right here with the change logs. So for the style menu, you can you know change your color as shown here. Um, you could auto do like other excuse me auto styler, and you could basically change the random color of the profile as shown here. So it basically randomizes that. Um, they have basically a little statistic log, basically just to you know keep. Uh, account of how many payloads you run or what certain type of payloads so there are a lot of cool stuff and new features within this as well of course here are a few of the mod menus for GTA 5 so I know a lot of people love to uh, you know mod Grand Theft Auto 5 so this is what I'm personally going to be using uh, this pro X project for a lot too um, there's also land for BO3 Call of Duty Online if you wanted to you know run it from like land servers and there's a whole bunch of stuff like app dump payloads there's also a new thing from like a pup decrypt so basically it decrypts updates from the usb root um there are also a fan control so if you have your playstation 4 and it's overheating you can you know up up the fan to cool your system off you could do a firmware spoof um avatar dumper you could also inject an avatar and you know a lot of more cool tools like that but just to show you the uh, stability of this since i already um beta tested this as well um as shown here it's gonna go ahead and run hen onto my playstation 4 it may take a little couple tries for your um startup as well but as shown here here's hen v 2.11 loaded and if i go into any of my fake package games let me see i'm just gonna go ahead and choose a random emulator 
of choice. So here, here's Virtual Arc Quick NES. As shown here, I'm able to boot up via with that, just like any other uh, payload as well. Um, but with that being stated, um, that's essentially on how to do this full process from the PC. Of course, you could use just any regular web server, and uh, I showcased a multitude of ways via in the intro. But with that being out of the way, my name is Nagato, and I am signing out. Hope you guys, you having a great day for today, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Of course, I love the llamas. Nice and silky smooth.